Hola amigos! I am here to do another thrift haul. This time I went to Helping Hands, which is in Bothell. They are always linked down below anytime I talk about stores. The reason why I love Helping Hands is because they have a 25 cent bin and then on Mondays or just like weekdays in general, sometimes they'll have flash sales as far as like a rack or a color that's a dollar or 50 cents. In this case, when I went on... Tuesday I went on Tuesday and of course I went to the 25 cent bin but before heading in they have racks on the outside of the actual building that have the it shows that it's a dollar or 50% off or half off and you know all that good stuff so this time it was orange tags that were 50 cents everything on the orange that has orange tags were 50 cents so I you know browsed through it and I was like okay cool and I found some things and then I went in went to the 25 cent bin and found some more things when I went to clarify to make sure that hey you know the things that are outside in the racks are they really 50% off I just want to make sure she's like well actually now they're 25 cents talking to one of the workers they told me that whenever they have sales like that and they have a lot of clothes left over because I went a little bit after three it's getting close to closing time they say that they just make a 25 cents just so that you know they can clear the racks and put more clothes out for the next day so ultimately this is just a 25 cent haul everything in this haul is 25 cents all right well again I've been filming differently so let's get right into those clips all right guys Let's do this. All right, so this is by Decree, it's in a size one. Yes, it looks absolutely crazy, but this is proof that if I didn't have these thighs, I could fit into size one jeans. Um, they are skinny jeans. They're obviously destroyed, obviously. And honestly, they fit me really well. I just cuffed them at the bottom just because they were a little bit longer. I think I would wanna put fishnets under this just to I don't know it's a lot of exposure and a lot of thigh so yeah um this was originally $9.99 but I got it for 25 cents alrighty these are American Eagle jeans they are I think they're like a I don't know if it's skinny because it flares out a little at the bottom I guess they're boot cut they're size two and they're a little bit of the dark wash but again I like how it fits it's a little bit tight around the butt area, but it's all right. So what I would usually do is just cuff it at the bottom, probably wear heels with it. Yeah. So this this was originally $7.99, um, but I got it for 25 cents. Alrighty, so I have these Levi's jeans. They're size 27 by 27, 14 regular. I can fit it in the leg area, but not in the waist area, I guess, or the butt area, it, like won't go over my upper thighs slash butt so yeah i'm actually really surprised about that but it is what it is i got this for 3.99 but again 25 cents these are capris from white house black market they are a size four and they are just black capris the cool thing about it is that it has ruching on the side right here like you can see that and it has a little like satin ribbon which is a little weird because this is like jean type of material and it's a little satin bow out of nowhere but I mean I like it it fits me pretty good uh, it gives me a lot of space right over here thighs and the butt so this was originally $12.99 but I got it for 25 cents alrighty these are I don't I think they're sweat slash capri joggers these are by champion in a size large yeah they're really really comfortable they're a little bit bigger up top so I just went ahead and and I folded the bottoms down because otherwise they would have come super up and they're like really well I guess it works too yeah 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 and I got this out of the 25 cent bin so there was no prices on it this has no tag but it is a gray skater type of skirt that has a more free-flowing material and I was gonna get this for my niece but it fits me so well um, I can wear it with heels or with some sneakers or something super cute and I like how free-flowing it is it's very you know so this was originally $5.99 but again I got it from I got it for 25 cents I have here boyfriend jeans by Eddie Bauer in a size 6. They're really loose, um, but they are boyfriend jeans. Here's that. really like it, actually. Like, I feel like I could wear this with, like, a white tee and some chucks or something. Or 
maybe some heels you never know the one thing that i was really iffy about were these patches i don't know if you can see them but they have patches on them and they're like sort of tacky looking but it's whatever <laughs> so these were originally 8.99 but again i got them from i got them for 25 cents okay so these khaki jeans are by gap and they're a size 27 by 4 or 4 by 27 i'm not sure how you would go about saying that ultimately a size 4 they're a little bit longer of course i'd wear it with heels and they're a lighter type of jean i don't know if you can see it and they have a double button on the top and yeah so these were originally $7.99 but again 25 cents okay, these are gap in a size 30 and they are a dark wash jeans they are a little bit more high-waisted not the type of high-waisted that i would like they have a little bit of worn worn destroyed type of things on the knees but they're really dark wash i guess you can never have more than enough dark wash jeans so yeah these were originally $7.99 but i got them for 25 cents okay this shirt is by ann taylor in a size large it's just a pink really free-flowing shirt it has slits on the bottom edging there on the sides and it's a v-neck and it's just really free-flowing and i like that so i can use this for the gym yoga or at home so this was originally 6.99 but again 25 cents this is by gap kits and it's in a size 10 so i bought this you guys just because it's great for layering it is like a blue with a green dark blue pattern on it and then when i fold the sleeves up it has that light like, it reminds me of like periwinkle but yeah and so i can either use this as a layering or put it around my waist so yeah this was originally 2.99 but again i got it for 25 cents this top is by lane bryant and it's one size fits all i know lane bryant is a plus size store but i don't know i just really liked it because it's like almost like poncho-ish but it has like an attachment right here it's what it seems like as you can see here um it's almost like that kimono type of vibe kimono sleeves that's what it's called and it's like a i want to say it's like a dark dark green with like white and gray pattern but i think what i pictured with this was uh you know like as a topper to go to the beach or something like you know just put this on top uh, of your bikini so yeah this was originally $6.99, but again, $0.25. Cents. This top is by Old Navy, and it's in a size small. Wow, you can really see my bra. <laughs> What's interesting about this top is that it's like really low, or it's really cut high up, and then the sides, they like flare out, almost like mermaid-ish. It has a striped pattern, if you can see there. And yeah, I just... Just a basic tee, pretty much for the most part, and you can never have more than enough basic items for layering. So the this was originally $2.99, but I got it from the 25 cents bin. Okay, this top is by Nike. It is a gray top with a black swoosh, light gray, and it fits just like a basic tee. Uh, this was originally $6.99, but I got it for 25 cents. Uh, I can wear this to the gym, yoga, all that good stuff. Alrighty, I got this shirt for my niece. It says, this tiaras make me taller. And it's a really cute, like, pink shirt with a uh, thermal sleeve here. Um, I'm not going to do a try on because obviously this is for my niece. But there you go. This was originally $6.99, but again, 25 cents. Okay, this blazer jacket is by Christopher and Banks in a size small and it's actually really interesting it has like ruffles along the edges as you can see here they have it on the both sleeves and they have it all along the back side there it's like a white color and then an off-white beige type of color and then it also is on the top portion as you can see there really interesting uh, I feel like the ruffles make it look a little bit more bulky than it really is. It doesn't look like a size small to me. I got this for my mom so she can probably layer it, wear it to church or something. Yeah. Forgot to say that this was uh, originally $9.99, but again, I got it for $0.25. Cents. This is an outerwear jacket. It is from Marona in a size small. And the pattern, I really like the colors of it. Uh, it's more of a dark fall type of pattern. Go great with like skinny jeans or something. Just as an outerwear, obviously, but part it's a little bit more on the wider side when it comes to outerwear i really like it either i might give this to my mom because 
I, with outerwear, I really like it when it like cinches me right here or if it just goes a little bit past my butt, so yeah. So this was originally $9.99, but again, I got it for 25 cents. Okay, so this is a outerwear jacket by Nat International Scene, and it's made in Yugoslavia. It's really bulky. I think it's a size extra large, but again, you guys know me and my oversized self. I love oversized everything. So yeah, this is like a brown type of material, and then it has fake fur here on the lining of the collar and I don't know, I just really like it. I, w I think I could like pair this with skinny jeans, a cute top, and then like just be all bundled up, you know? And, or you can just put it down like this, wear it like that, you know? Be like a basic. <laughs> but this was originally $9.99, but again, got it for 25 cents. All right, so ultimately I have 17 pieces all together that I got for 25 cents, so that equal to four dollars and 96 cents so 17 items for four dollars and 96 cents you cannot go wrong Alrighty, well i hope you guys like this video if you guys did go and give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos by me click that red subscribe button it would totally make my day don't forget to click on the bell on there just so you can be notified of any new <laughs> of any new videos that i upload as soon as i upload them all right well i hope to see you guys in my next video and just so you guys know, I do have a second vlogging channel as a lot of YouTubers do. And this is just uh, my whereabouts, what I'm doing, randomness, and just anything that is not in this whole sit down type of thing. So yeah, go ahead and check it out. It's always linked down below as, as well as my other social media stuff. You know, you know, you know. All right, I will see you guys later. Bye.